All right, guys, in today's video, I am playing this Executor Butterfree deck. Um, got me thinking about it with the new Erica uh, accessories and the new Butterfree promo. Been wanting to play it for a long time. Um, I had a very insane game against an Articuno Greninja deck, so I'm actually probably going to put that first in the video, even though it was the last game that I recorded, just because I want to put a good game first, obviously. But the main idea is to use Executor as your main attacker, keep him alive forever, and just eventually uh, get the game. You do play Butterfree Beats a significant amount in this deck. And um, the reason you don't want to pair Butterfree with something like Venusaur is because um, you can't have two things that are requiring a bunch of energy, otherwise you're never pressuring your opponent. And so you can uh, just use one energy on the Executor, then build up the Butterfree in the back. The Butterfree does have one retreat, and so it becomes a very like energy efficient deck this way. Um, Unfortunately, the Metapod has two retreat, but that barely ever comes up. And then, you know, we just have the two potions for more healing, the Pokeballs, the research for more consistency. Erica's for more healing and the Sabrina to buy us some time and to, um, you know, get that KO if we need it. So I um, had a lot of fun with this deck. Um, the game against the Articuno player was very, very stressful. It just went on and on and on and on. Uh, but it was a very good game. Uh, really want to appreciate everyone that is supporting the channel. It's growing like really insane. I'm getting like a uh, thousand plus subs a week. So really appreciate that. And uh, with that being said, let's just get into the gameplay. All right. Going first. Okay. Wrong one, but maybe it can find us the right one. Or research can. Articuno, okay. Articuno Greninja. Can't play around red card, but this deck is just too much to... There's a lot of setup already. Hmm. Hopefully we don't get Misty sacked here. That would be very bad. No Misty, please? Yes. I think we go energy and we have to metapod, unfortunately. Do I even want a Sabrina? I mean, Froki energy attachments. 30 damage. I think it's worth it still, just because we have Butterfree. We already have two Erika's and Potions, so we might be able to get there. We'll see. I'm hoping they just don't have the fr um, Frogadier. Is that what it's called? Frogadier? I think so. Oh, of course they do. And then they can retreat into 40 with Geo to knock out Metapod. So I have to evolve to play around that situation. Okay. Okay, let's heal. So I don't actually have to use anything right now. I mean, maybe we just uh, try and gust our way to victory with the heals. I mean, that sounds very unlikely, but we do go back to one retreat. So it's possible maybe we can set up an executor before we, we lose this way. Good. Super needed that. Uh, sure. So they're dealing 80, I can heal 70, but I can two-tap them. Okay. Very nice. I don't think they're going to be able to 80-20 me unless they have another Misty retreat and flip heads. So I don't think it's worth it to use Potion here. Okay. 
If they have all that, I mean, like, good for them, you know? I'm betting the potion's more useful later. Okay. It is nice that the Butterfree sets up all the things they're trying to do with Blizzard math, which is great. So I'm never, I should never die to a Blizzard bench attack. Okay, he's trying to preserve the Greninja now. Which I understand. But now I'm going to retreat and put up a wall. Is he going to go for the eggs in the back? No, he's going to go for the butter. I thought he was going to go for the Butterfree, so that way he could Blizzard it next turn, but I guess not. Oh, God. Fine. So obnoxious. Give me another one. Uh. Man, this would have been so sweet. Like a 60 into 80. He's not attaching to the Articuno. To deal 80 and then 100. Why? Why to the Greninja? That's insanity. That's insanity. Hopefully, there's not another Sabrina. Do I just Erica here? I think... I think I do. Okay. Now, no matter what, he can't take out my Butterfree. If he Sabrina's me again... Uh, okay, good. Good. I just need to get my thick boy on the board here. Has he used both Misties? No. Okay. Okay. <laughs> okay, got it anyway. <laughs> I was supposed to be so tilted by this degeneracy. Okay. I actually don't know if I can bench anything else. Well, I'm drawing some more healing, which is great. I mean, should I try and set up another executor? Yeah, wait, I can I can bench one more. What am I saying? Yeah, we're super good here. And then we can heal up. And now we can retreat. Okay, we're going to try and build this guy up again. And doesn't matter what I flip. Okay. He can't bring up the Greninja unless he just wants to risk losing the game to Butterfree. If he thinks I have like an aneurysm and forget. How many potions has he gone through? None. That could be the plan as well. Butterfree and Greninja are a wash. Okay, he's trying to wall me out now. This, this play gives me a lot of time unless he gets Misty Heads, right? This guy. This guy's driving me nuts. Oh, God. 
Dude, everything that can go right for this guy goes right for this guy. This is this is beyond this is beyond obnoxious. We got Serena, we have a Serena victory. And there's one in the bottom four, I think. That's not it. This is unreal. I literally needed both of these potions to live. He's thinking the same stuff about me, probably. Okay. But I can't get the heads I need. Heads there would have led to... Well, actually, I just needed double heads no matter what. Hopefully, Sabrina can still win me the game. I think I have two in here. Oh, my goodness. I hate this. I hate this guy. All my healing has gone outside of Butterfree. So, I have a Butterfree top deck. Sabrina top deck. Butterfree doesn't even save me anymore. Healing for 40 doesn't do anything. I'm still taking 60. Mm hmm. Just give me a Sabrina. I really hope I have two in this deck. I don't remember. I just made it. What a game. He's got to have he's got to have potions by now. He just has to. He has to have potions. There's no way he doesn't run potions, right? Unless he cut potions for for what? Red card and the the Greninja, the Greninja line, I don't know. Oh, he can still Sabrina my Metapod. Well, it's okay. He can just chill there. Okay, X speed. Okay, double X speed into what? The Greninja to make me flip heads. This guy's evil. Oh, and he's gonna go for twenty. Yeah. This game is totally insane. Okay. Uh huh. If we had top deck Butterfree, we don't lose to this line either. This is just. This is just something else. Sabrina doesn't win me the game anymore. I literally just have to get heads now. There's the Sabrina now. Naturally. Okay. Mm. Yes. Oh baby. Get out of here. Dude. That guy with every play he made was like the play he needed to continue to make while I'm sitting here suffering trying to find particular things. Oh my goodness. Okay, that was a great game though. That was a great game. Jesus. Well, I hope you guys enjoyed it. Hope you enjoyed my suffering. And um, I will see you guys soon. All right, let's see if we can cheese this at all. Okay, we're going first, which is what we want with this deck. Don't say that very often, but... Really need to see Executor here. 
do 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 Not it. Butterfree at least. Or Caterpie, excuse me. Okay, at least we have the Caterpie. So we can start that evolution line. Unfortunately, two reckless charges nukes this execute, which is not good. <clears throat> okay, well, they're setting up very nicely. Probably running the fossil variation, if I had to guess. Fantastic, fantastic top deck. I am just going to go ahead and use this, I think. Yeah, why not? Makes the red cards less good if they happen to be running them. Doesn't matter what I flip here. Very nice top deck. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and they just concede. We will certainly take that. Okay. Going first again. Okay, this time we're starting off a little bit differently. We'll get to see how good this is. Another Pikachu deck. <laughs> okay, we have eggs. Obviously going second would have been really, really great with the starting Caterpie. So going first with Caterpie is probably like almost the worst this deck can open, I would imagine. Okay, he's definitely got all the basics he needs. At least, if not right now, soon enough. Okay. Is he going for the Peck Geo Peck? That's totally fine with me, bro. I need to find eggs. Hmm. Still haven't found it. Hmm. Interesting attachment. Okay, X speed to deal 20. So that means he just has to have Electrode. That's the only thing that makes any sense, right? Hand is pretty scuffed here. I think I am still going to attach here and try and find the coconuts. Okay, we have a Metapod. I mean, still thin the deck out by one. If I end up, if I try and go Caterpie into Caterpie, I leave myself vulnerable to Sabrina unless I get both executors. I'm not sure what choice I have other than to go for that right now, though. I think I have to go for that line because I just have no Evos. Okay, there's Metapod. Yeah, I think we just have to search for Executor. There's Butterfree. Okay, so now we have all of the worthless ones in the back. This is very unlucky. No researches either. And now he just gets to build the Zapdoses, unfortunately. Okay. And then just attack me. Uh-huh. Okay. There's one research. 
Can I get the executor? There it is. Okay, now like I said, we are vulnerable to Sabrina, but there's just really nothing we can do about it at this point. And we get Tails, that's a bummer. So basically everything that's going wrong is going wrong right now. And we'll just see if they have the Sabrina. If they do, we just concede. Pokeball, okay. Maybe that's finally their first Pikachu. Potion to make me flip heads. Fair enough. While they build up the Zapdos in the back. Mm-hmm. Oh, it was Voltorb. Okay. No Sabrina. All right, so we can Erica, and we also have to potion because it'll make the Zapdos have to flip uh, all four, and hopefully we can get a heads here. We do get a heads. So if they get some bad rolls with the Zapdos, have no Serena, and I get double heads, I can still win this game. Not the most likely thing to occur, but it's still possible. Sabrina doesn't really help me for the rest of this game because they can just either retreat for free with an Electrode if they had it. They could use X-Speed to pivot out. And after this turn, they can just attach and retreat. So Sabrina is pretty dead. Yep, there's the Electrode. So Sabrina is super, super not useful. Okay. And then they Sabrina me. They could potentially get all tails, so I guess I'll I'll sit for that. Okay, well, that was extremely unlucky in several ways. But um you know, let's see how we do next game. Alright. Going first, good, that's what we want again. Nice. Very good hand. We just need to find good old coconuts. And we will be doing very well. Pikachu. Really need to find it. Okay, we found it. Um, I'm actually just going to pass here in case I get red carded. I have everything I need besides Butterfree. So we'll see. Okay, research. Now, over the course of two attacks, if we get uh, one heads, that's great. Now, one argument, if you're not worried about getting red carded, the research could have got me closer to an Erica, which could be really important. So we'll just have to see how badly this matters. They definitely have more basics in hand, right? Okay, let's go ahead and maybe find our another eggs here. Nope, another Caterpie, that's fine. So we can evolve. We can evolve. Play the Caterpie. Play the research. Okay, we found Erica anyway. This is just fantastic. Okay, but we can potentially get uh, heads next turn, and that's something they have to worry about at least. Gonna be attaching energy to Metapod, so that way if we get Butterfree, we can, you know, maybe take out this Pikachu. Okay, they definitely have enough basics now, so they're gonna be swinging for 90, but we are mitigating 50 of that damage with Erica. 
potentially 70 if I top deck Butterfree. Which is quite strong. Okay, they have a potion, so they're they're in it, they're in it. Is there not another basic? That's a huge deal. So Erica basically blanks his entire turn. Which is fantastic. Draw another Erica. Wow. Okay, so I'm gonna I'm gonna make him think I top deck this one if he's paying attention. That I didn't have one before. And now over the course of two attacks, I need one heads. There it is. So the Pikachu's guaranteed dead next turn, even if they have another potion. <laughs> they might just scoop at this point. Retreat into Zapdos, try and absorb some damage, perhaps. Raichu Surge does not one-shot Executor, thank goodness. <laughs> He's got to retreat this Pikachu, I think. Or is he just going to try and build it up? We'll see. Maybe he just doesn't want to give up the 90. Okay. It's actually really good news for me. Now, this is probably going to annoy him greatly. Build here. Um, I think we just go ahead. We're all in on this um, executor, I think. Just make these red cards really bad if he happens to run any. Okay. How many cards we have left? Seven and two Butterfreeze. Have we used both researches? No. So in the bottom seven, we have two Butterfreeze and a research. That's pretty good. Not to mention we have another executor. Yeah, he's going to go for trying to uh, Thundering Hurricane me to death. Uh, the pecs don't matter here. Well, I guess they do because it changes it from three to two. Hopefully, if I top deck um, Butterfree, that'll change. Okay, good. This makes him have to get three, which I'm sure is infuriating. And... Let's actually go here in case I need a retreat. I like that. Okay. Tails is unfortunate, but hopefully they have some bad luck as well. We would need two heads because we have no Giovanni in this deck, so... It wasn't very likely we take this out quickly. Sabrina is also in our deck, which could be very nice. Slow him down a bit here. Hmm. I guess, I guess we'll see if we get sacked here. Ooh, not good. Not good. Okay, 100 isn't... You know, above rate. We have used all of our heal. Okay, here's a Sabrina. The problem is, is now he just attaches and retreats. So we have to make it suck for him to... Um, attack back. So let's use Powder Heal. So he'll at least have to roll um, more than one heads if he stays in. I think we attach here. We have Tails again, but he has to have Potion to survive the Butterfree attack. And he's already used one potion, but there's only four cards in his deck, so he could potion me here. So, I mean, we could still lose this. It's going a little bit sideways for me, unfortunately. We're probably going to top deck like Metapod next turn. Okay. So, is he trying to write you me? And then switch out and then Thunder Hurricane? No. 
He's just hoping I won't flip heads. Okay, that seems weird. Okay, this was very helpful. Okay, let's heal some more. Do we take the kill or do we pivot into the other eggs? Is there any merit to that? I don't think so. I think we just go for game, right? I think we actually attach here. I think we just go for game. And we get it. Very nice. Okay, I'll certainly take it.